I had been doing some online dating. I just found that people would be really fake yeah. and you'd try to set up a, a time to meet and then they just would ghost you, yeah. like they just disappear. I'd looked at speed dating as an option, but the idea of having to be forced to meet like so many different people in a set time really kind of freaked me out. Whereas with organic fusions, it was just a bunch of people hanging out, very relaxed and taking your own time meeting people. I had gone through a period where I'd lost my confidence, mainly because I'd gotten sick. So I'd gotten really sick, kind of shut myself off from the world and didn't know how to sort of get back into it. Not a pubs and clubs person. I didn't know how to meet single people, how to connect with people other than through the internet. And that was clearly not working well. A friend introduced me. She found an article in the newspaper and suggested that it might be a good way to find a man. So I, I kind of went with the intention of hoping to meet somebody. But I've made some really awesome friends, been on some fun dates and got a job. I've found by going to these organic fusions events that my self-esteem and my confidence has definitely improved and it's been the best it's been in like many years. Some of the events that I've really enjoyed and tried are like some of the food events, like the Korean barbecue, the Greek dinner, Wawa G's, that was amazing. Lawn bowls, try that out. <laughs> Even with a broken leg. Oh, there's so many. There's so many different ones. My favorite event would probably have to be game tonight. I seem to always enjoy that one. It's always attracts different people and you just get to like be like a big kid, which is seriously what I am. <laughs> one of the things I loved with organic fusions is that we're encouraged to hang out with the people after like after events and that's where I met a couple of guys we went out for a few drinks after a few events then we decided to swap numbers then we just hung out had lunch dates one of them's turned into a really good friend call him my wingman everyone is friendly Sarah's amazing as a host did recommend organic fusions to a friend of mine he was really hesitant and all I kept doing was banging on about how awesome Organic Fusions was and how much fun I had. Told him about some of the events that I'd been to, some of the things that I'd done. And I got him to come. I told him I'd be his wing woman, which is one of the things I love, is that the girls support each other, the guys support each other. And just, to, like, he ended up having great fun. I loved the concept of little technology and more face-to-face. -face. Getting back to the old-fashioned values like it was just more than a place to find a, a guy and a date. It's kind of become a like a little mini family almost. But for the first few events I went to, I didn't even discuss things like ages and jobs. That just didn't even come into conversation. It was about getting to know them, what they enjoy doing. And, you know, you just forget about the minor things like what they do for a job and how old they exactly are, because that stuff's not really that important. It's about the connections and about who they are as a person, not what they do. Sarah's really great at organizing little icebreaker conversations and I often find that they lead into much more in-depth conversations. Didn't necessarily think organic fusions would change my life, but I'd have to say it has. I've probably been with organic fusions about eight months at this point. I'm loving life. I've managed to get a job, looking at a second job, study all things that I really didn't think were going to be possible. But by getting my confidence back and my happiness back, I've been able to do other things in my life as well.